In this video, we will review managing reports subscriptions in the downloadable reports section of the CyberSource Business Center. To begin, from the left navigation menu, select Reports. In the downloadable reports section, click Report Subscription Management. This page will allow you to create or edit report subscriptions or create ad hoc reports. A recurring report is built on a daily, weekly, or monthly frequency. According to your permissions, you may enable recurring report subscriptions from this page. The page is organized into three tabs, Standard Report Subscriptions, Classic Report Subscriptions, and Custom Report Subscriptions. The Standard Reports Subscriptions tab contains various types of pre-configured reports that you may subscribe to. Additionally, you may perform some basic report configurations, such as setting the frequency or the format. Note, some merchants will see different report types on this page, depending on the products for which the merchant is enabled. You can retrieve your enabled standard reports by navigating to the left navigation menu under Reports, Downloadable Reports, then click Available Reports. Consider the example of the Transaction Request Report. To enable this report, click the More icon, select Change Report Status, click Enable, then click Confirm. This report is now enabled. It will occur on a daily frequency. It will contain transactions between 12 a.m. to 11.59 p.m. in the Pacific time zone, and the report will be in a CSV format. If you would like to make further customizations to a standard report, you can select Copy to create a new copy and open the new report for editing from this page. To create a new report, click Create Custom Subscription. If you are a partner or account level user, you may choose which merchants will appear in your report. Your report may cover all merchants, one merchant, or a group of merchants, which we will talk about later in the training. Next, you will choose Basic Report Setup Options. You will specify a report name, file format, and subscription frequency. In the Advanced Report Features section, choose how you would like credits to appear in your report. You may also filter your report to contain only certain types of transactions, etc. Note that not every configuration option will be available for every report. Additionally, you may see more configuration options depending on the report you have chosen. You can also select the fields that you would like to have in your report. And you can reorder your fields in the Field Ordering tab. When you are satisfied, click Create to save the report. To see your new customized report, select the Custom Report Subscriptions tab. Reports will be listed in alphabetical order, or you can search for a report using a keyword in the Quick Search field. If you would like to make an entirely new report based off your custom report, then choose Copy. If you would like to create a new subscription from scratch, click the Create Customer Subscription button. Let's use the Copy feature to create a one-time report. A one-time report is an ad hoc report that will run only once and will cover a period of time in the past. This is a convenient way of creating a report that looks back into your transaction history and can cover a period of up to 31 days. You can retrieve your one-time report by navigating to the left navigation menu under Reports, Downloadable Reports, then click Available Reports. Now that you have learned how to manage reports, let's look at how to create a group. Groups are a logical collection of merchants corresponding to your business need. For example, you may choose to create groups by region or business unit. To create a group, from the left navigation menu, select Account Management Group Management. If you have already created groups, they will be listed. You can edit a group by clicking on the Edit button. To create a new group, click Add Group. Enter the group name and optionally provide a description. Then choose the merchants that you would like to add to your group. Click Create. Then click Yes to create the new group. Thank you for watching this video on Report Subscription Management. For additional help, please refer to the online help in the Business Center.